Nikki Cheatham, the producer of that programme, and Irene, who appeared in the film, will be on open air tomorrow morning on BBC One. If you have a question for them, or you'd like to comment on tonight's programme, please ring this number, 061 814 0424. The lines are open now. 40 Minutes next week sets out to trace the stories of ordinary people who've experienced a close encounter with Her Majesty the Queen, like the hotel manager who one snowy night was asked for a room for Her Majesty, and the fruit and veg man who crashed his van, and guess who came to the rescue? 40 Minutes on the day I met the Queen at 9.30 next Thursday. Film drama for Sunday evenings with the return of Screen 2. In Angel Voices, Michael Williams is Tommy, choir master of a northern boys' choir. It's the summer of 63, and the choir makes its annual visit to Blackpool. But the boys are restless. 63 is the year of the Beatles, and the youth of Britain are about to hit the headlines. Don't chess it up, Slater. Ice Dance, a story of teenage ambition and dreams of success. But can the dreams of so many people withstand the pressures of competition? Anybody can slip. But one slip isn't the end of the world, is it? It's the not getting up again I can't fathom. And to start the season, Death of a Son, Lynn Redgrave in the story of a mother's fight for justice. In the absence of statutory provisions to the contrary, any person may, of his own initiative, and without any preliminary consent, institute criminal proceedings with a view to an indictment. Screen 2, film drama for Sunday evenings, here on 2. And now on BBC 2, it's time to cross the Atlantic for another three comic playlets with Tracy Ullman.